am starting off with my foundation, my favorite foundation ever, L'Oreal True Match, and I'm in the color um, W5. I've got a little bit of a tan now. So I'm just buffing that in with, I believe it's a Real Techniques buffing brush. And then I'm going to go ahead and highlight my face with my Shape Tape Concealer. Um, I don't remember what shade this is right now. Um, clearly it's too light for me, so I just use the same foundation brush to kind of blend it in so it doesn't stick out quite as much, but we still get a nice highlight. And normally I would use a beauty blender, but I am on the road, so I have a travel size kit with me, so I kind of just have to double up on some brush uses um, while we're in the car. And then I am just using this other Real Techniques brush, um, which is a little more densely packed to blend out my under eye concealer. my Koki Contour Highlight Palette and I am taking some of the um, two lightest highlighting shades and I am just using that to kind of set my concealer and highlight I'm just using that same brush and then I'm taking my Physicians Formula Butter Bronzer I'm in love with this and I'm using my big powder brush and then this is where I'm setting um, like my foundation and the outer portions of my face and we're really getting that neck because we don't want we don't want any lines of demarcation and then I am grabbing um, the darkest contour shade out of the Koki palette and just this little brush and I am doing some contouring on my face as you can see went a little heavy on the nose I will fix that later <laughs> This is from Palette I got at TJ Maxx, and I've had it forever. And I'm just buffing that in to my cheeks, and I'm using the blush also to kind of blend out the bronzer and contour there so we have a very seamless blend on our cheeks. Then I'm taking this Wet n Wild highlighter I used in my last Get Ready With Me. Love it so much. I love it. They have a lot of different other shades too. Really inexpensive, really amazing. And I'm just using this little highlighting brush from Real Techniques and I am highlighting my face and okay this is my favorite brow pencil and it, I always run out of it like super fast this is like um, a NYX brow pencil and I barely had anything left so I had to just use what I had to try to get my <laughs> brows looking in shape but they were very light and natural for that day against my will that is all I had to work with I think we made it work all right, I'm now using the Naked Heat palette and I'm taking a little um, eyeshadow brush and I'm just putting the lightest shimmery beige color um, on my inner corners, all over my lids and under my brow bone. I'm doing a super simple eye look today. Um, just because we're traveling and in the car and um, that's just what I was feeling. And then I'm taking the um, the next two shades, next to the lightest shade <laughs> with a fluffy brush, sorry, they're kind of the beige or tan shades and I'm mixing them both together and I am definitely just putting that in my crease and then I'm taking a little bit of one of the burnt orange colors in that palette and I'm um, intensifying my outer corner just a touch. And we set the face with an e.l.f. setting spray, honey. And then we are doing mascara, which is very difficult in the car. Definitely got it all over my face several times. You know, almost stab my eye, but we made it happen. And I am then using my other mascara. I usually like to have two mascaras at a time to be able to mix and match and get your lashes real nice and big. And then I am using a liquid lipstick. I can't remember which one it is. I'm the worst, guys. Um, it's a drugstore liquid lipstick. I think it's a Revlon one. Um, and it is so hard to do liquid lipstick in the car. Like, I literally didn't think I was going to be able to do it. But I don't know how I pulled through. I made it happen. And I'm pretty proud of it. Yes. 
destiny. Get those edges of those lips. So hard in the commune. One bump and you're done for. Okay. Next, I'm going to be taking a Jeffree Star liquid lipstick in Nudist Peach. And I'm just going to use that to highlight my lips. Give them a little more dimension. I'm going to just use my ring finger to tap that right in the center. Tap it in. And that is it, you guys. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope it was fun for you and interesting. This was just a little simple look I was doing on the road. And I hope you'll consider subscribing to my channel, giving a thumbs up, and I will see you in my next video. Bye. Thank you.